QuickBooks does not always apply the payment to the amounts due. So when somebody will make a payment, sometimes it will show that as a credit on their statement and it will never have been applied to the amounts that they owe us. So their statement will get be messy. So in order to see which ones are in that situation, you go to reports, then you select customers and receivables, then you select AR aging summary. And we'll generate this report. Cheryl Wild has $27 as a credit, but that is over 90 days old. If this credit hangs out forever and you know that she's closed her account, what you'll want to do is go to customers, customer detail center for a while, then uh, double click on this. You would go to edit and delete payment and delete anything else in there that would, that would allow her to have any balance whatsoever. And then she would disappear from our AR summary report. Let's take a look at Fernando Braverman. Looks like he has some amounts that are owed to us and he also has some credits or payments uh, to us. So we will go to customers, customer detail center, type in FE, brings up Fernando Braverman, push enter, views, shows us all the items on the screen. So we notice he has some payments and uh, some credit memos. That would be if we did a return in the register. And the payment, of course, is a payment on account. So let's go to customers, receive payments, type in FE, select set credits to use those credits, which are $208.48. And we'll apply those credits to these. Okay, now let's clear up the NAC generic account, which we see has some credits on it. Customer Detail Center, NAC generic account. We have some payments. Scroll to the bottom. Select everything that you can which in this case looks like everything that's on the screen. Select save and close.